gather today to remember a man of fearless vision who sought to change the world. And change the world he did. Look around. Even now the British prepare to retreat. Their spirits broken. Their forces splintered. The Patriot leadership shall soon follow. Either into our service He sent me away that day at Fort George. He feared for my safety. I should have stayed. He said there was no danger. He was wrong. I will kill you, Connor. This I swear. Not here, though. Not today. No. First... First, I'll destroy all you hold dear. I'll burn that homestead of yours to the ground and roast the seven heads of your precious founding fathers in its flames. And when I've finished with them, all the rest will burn as well. Your merry band of assassins, the human refuse that lives on your land, your village and its people, all of it, gone. You can try, Charles. But as with all your schemes, this too will end in failure. Get him on his feet. He will wait. He will watch. And then, when he's seen all his life's work brought to ruin, only then will I allow him to die. Take him away. Oh, hello. Charles Lee gone. The harbor. To catch a ferry. Yeah. 
there. Coward! Get back here! He's off! These men meet the requirements. You believe incorrectly. They're sick and weak. We're looking to build an army, not fill an almshouse. It would take months to get them in a fighting shape. We don't have the time. No, please. We'll do anything you want. Anything. Only take us with you. Quiet, well. Your merchandise is useless to us. Perhaps we should discuss this back in my cabin. As you should be, for us to have come all this way for nothing. Tell me now why I shouldn't have you thrown into the sea. No need to be rash. Only give me a little more time. I'll scour the other ships if I must. I'm certain there are prisoners who will meet your needs. Very well. You have two days. Thank you. Present yourself to the Green Dragon Tavern in Boston with the men you've chosen. We shall meet you there along with our master. <laughs> <laughs> 